guys, how are y'all doing today? Two videos in one day. I know, I don't know what to say. Everything else is weird, why not this? Uh, but I wanted to get this out pretty quickly uh, because I'm not sure if these, I'm not sure how many are still available. So this is the brand new Jimmy Choo lipsticks. And this is the satin lip color. I ordered three from Harrods. Harrods is the only place that I think it's available right now that is shipping to the United States. It was a UK exclusive for a while. Now I'm shipping to the US. I ordered three colors. I only got two. Um, I'm pretty sure that the color that I ordered that didn't come was the lighter pink color that was like more of an everyday. I'm not surprised that one sold out first. So I literally bought it. It was, I paid for it. It was in, you know, and then they wrote me and said that it had to be canceled because they didn't have enough stock. So that's what it looks like. It's in like a leather pouch. Let's see if I can now pull it out. That's what that looks like. Lipstick pulls out like that. It's not, is it magnetic? Doesn't seem to be magnetic. Um, and then you just sit like this. So this one, this, this color, okay, I think I'm gonna start to need glasses. That's not good. I've been staring at the computer too much for the, for the last two weeks. This is Burgundy Charm is the name. And I'm gonna swatch it for you and then I'll put it on my lips. I don't have anything on today except for uh, mascara because I'm trying out a mascara for you guys. Um, trying to see how it wears, how it flakes. So far, I absolutely love it. I think it looks really good on it. it, it I know it's not about mascara, but I really like the mascara. I'll tell you about it soon. Okay, that's the color. It's a really pretty color. All right, let's try it on. Okay. I'm gonna put this back into its case. Okay, I'm gonna get Close, I'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so what I would say about the consistency, it's a little smooth, it's a little, it's very smooth. It feels really good, but it's a little bit more, it's not as creamy as say the Hermes lipsticks. The Hermes lipsticks were more creamy, a little denser, a little thicker. This one is a little bit thinner of a consistency. I can already tell that it's going into my um, fine lines around my mouth a little bit. Not a lot, I mean, it doesn't look bad. It looks really pretty, it feels nice. It went on really easily, but it does have a thinner consistency. Again, these are satin lip colors. It does have a nice satin look to it. It's a beautiful color. It doesn't have a smell. Well, it does actually, it has a slight scent, but it's not, it's not anything um, overly dramatic, but it does, it does feel like it's, I'm just kind of like, I don't know, it feels thinner, almost like, it's hard to explain. Um, it just feels like a thinner consistency. It's not as luxurious as I think I thought it was gonna be, but you know, we'll give it some time. These are first impressions. I might feel very differently. And by the way, on the lipstick itself, there's a C embossed on the lipstick and then the sides of the lipstick kind of look like snakeskin. I would try to, I'll show you, I'll try to show you on the viewfinder, but I don't know if that's gonna come through. Okay, so that color, by the way, that I just showed you is Daring Pink. I'll put Daring Pink next to Burgundy Charm. They're similar colors, actually. It's a little bit lighter. Okay, I will zoom you in again so you can see the color. This is a beautiful color. I actually like the Daring Pink, I think a little more on me than the, um, what was the other one? What was the other one? Burgundy Charm. 
I think it's a really pretty color, actually. It's something I would wear all the time. I'm gonna have to wear it for a while to give you a really in-depth review on it. See how it wears, see if it settles into the fine lines. Um, see what the consistent, like the um, longevity of it is. Off the top of my head though, I would say the colors are beautiful. The packaging, I mean, it, that's, that's pretty gorgeous, I have to say. I mean, like, I know it's you're getting reflection. There we go. If that's on your counter, that's, that's gonna look pretty stunning. Um, it feels good, uh, and I do like it. I'm only comparing it to the Hermes because that is the most recent luxury line lipstick that's come out, and just first impression, just first impression, I like the Hermes a little bit more. I think because my skin is so dry, that one felt more nourishing, more creamy to me. But this is lovely. So far, so good. Uh, I will certainly try to get other colors in the future if they're available to me, and we'll keep you up to date on how they wear and how it looks. I'll pin a comment uh, in this video later on, you know, let a couple days pass and see how they wear to let you all know. But I just wanted to do this really quick review so you guys could see it if there are still some available for you guys to order. Oh, and really, really quickly, um, because of everything that's going on right now, I've decided to move up the giveaway for the Pat McGrath Divine Rose. So we're gonna do it on April 1st, which is next Wednesday. So if you're interested in entering, put, your, um, put in the comments below your Instagram handle. Make sure you're following me on Instagram because that's where I'm gonna do the giveaway. That's how I'm gonna contact the winner. April 1st, next Wednesday. Just wanted to give you that heads up. So in case you were thinking you had more time, it's less than a week. So again, thank you so much for watching this video. Like, subscribe, it helps my channel grow. Thank you so much for being here today. Have a wonderful rest of your week.